everyone, it's Mao from Sparkly Belly. Decorative cutouts on costume skirts create such a fancy and unique look. In this video, you will see how to make these small cutouts and still keep your skirt nice and sturdy. So let's get started. To make cutouts, you need interfacing. You can use light to medium weight interfacing. Paper, a skirt. For belly dancing costumes, cutouts are often made in snug parts of a skirt. So a straight skirt or a mermaid skirt that is snug around the thighs will be a good skirt to use and your sewing tools. First, draw the shape of the cutout you want to make on a piece of paper and cut it out. This will serve as your cutout pattern. Then place the pattern where you want the cutout to be on your skirt and trace the pattern. Here I'm using a piece of velvet for demonstration but I will show you an example with a skirt later. Take the same pattern and trace it on the interfacing. Then cut it about two and a half centimeters or one inch away from the line. Now place the interfacing on the right side of the skirt. Line up the lines on the interfacing and the skirt and pin it in place. Then sew right along the lines. I'm using black thread so you can see but for yours use matching color thread. Now take your scissors and cut out the inside of the lines. Be careful not to cut the stitches and try to cut a few millimeters or one eighth of an inch or so away from the stitches. Then flip the interfacing towards the wrong side of the fabric, then place pins all around. This creates a nice clean edge for your cutout. Then go back to your sewing machine and do a top stitch at whatever seam allowance you're comfortable with. Just trim the excess interfacing on the inside and now the cutout is ready to be embellished. If you want to add mesh to the cutout, just take the same pattern and cut out with a couple of centimeters seam allowance, just like we did for the interfacing. Then pin it to the back of the cutout and do a straight stitch around it. You'll be able to see the stitches from earlier, so just follow the stitches. If you remember, this is a mermaid skirt I made in last week's video. Because the fabric has a polka dot pattern, I've created a few circle cutouts using this technique and did some beading around the cutouts. It is a bit hard to see on camera, but this is a cutout with mesh, and this one has no mesh. Mesh is optional, but I personally like the look of mesh filled cutouts and it makes the cutouts sturdier. You can do beading on the mesh, so it gives you more options for your design as well. Hope this video sparks new ideas for your costume making. If you liked the video, please share it with your belly dancing friends and help me spread the word. And also, sign up for the Sparkly Belly newsletter on my blog to get more DIY belly dance costuming ideas and free patterns. Thanks for watching and keep sparkling!